Yo, it's me, Dead Carpet, and this is Dead Carpet Energy Drink Review since 4.48 p.m. And it's on Friday, September 8th, 2023. Anyway, today I'm going to be reviewing another one of these good idea, like, energy sparkling water drinks. They say they're energy drinks, but um, they don't have any caffeine, so they're a little bit more unique and interesting. Um, but yeah, they have some, like, other ingredients, I guess, that can help with, like, energy. Um, but yeah, um, this one might be okay. We shall see about this one, because, um, yeah, the last one I didn't really like. But, um, uh, this flavor, I reviewed a, a flavor of this type of drink before, but it was like, um, the Cycling Frog, like it was a CBD drink. But they had this flavor. Um, but we shall see if this one, like, compares to that flavor, I guess. Um, but yeah, anyway, today I'm going to be reviewing the Savart Vin Bar Black Current. Good idea, like, energy, like, sparkling water sort of drink. So, oh yeah, boys, look at that can. So, oh yeah, oh yeah, oh yeah, oh yeah. Definitely reflective. It's like a shiny purple color. Um, so yeah. And that's the silver top of the silver tab. The bomb's the Best Buy Dayton production code. And Best Buy September 27th, 2024. So it's still fresh for a while. It's like a silverish goldish color top. But when I showed off the can up close, um, I thought it was just silver. Um, that's cause I didn't have good lighting in the hallway, you know, but yeah, it's like a golden silver color. It's like halfway between gold and halfway between like chrome. So definitely interesting color. But yeah, it's on a label can with a smooth texture. Um, this one looked like it got like melted or something on it. It's like the label's like messed up on that side. Don't know if you can tell though cause of the camera, but um... It's like messed up. But yeah, around the top it says zero calories, zero sweetener, zero caffeine. It says the same thing on the other around the other side. Harness your natural energy, good idea. Feel good, live good. Savarta Vin Bar, black current, sparkling water, 12 ounces, 355 milliliters. So yeah, this is the second black current drink that I'm reviewing. First one was that cycling frog, um, THC seltzer like drink. Um, but yes, we shall see about this one if it tastes similar to that one. Um, but yeah, anyway, prime to metabolism, balanced blood sugar, sustainable energy, electrolytes for hydration, zinc for immunity, zero junk non-GMO. Has a QR code, projects on our website, scan for adventure. Shows like a fire, a water droplet, a lightning bolt, um, person kicking like a cell. Like, um, no chemicals, you know. Vegan, keto friendly, non-GMO, gluten free. Good news, did you know that balanced blood sugar not only keeps our metabolism at its best, but also keeps our skin, body, and mind younger and energized? Good idea helps to balance blood sugar and is the result of our 20 years of research on natural properties and foods and 10 plus um, UN clinical trials. Its blend of five essential amino acids and chromium picolinate primes your metabolism and reduces after meal blood sugar naturally. So the result is more sustainable natural energy without a single drop of caffeine or sugar, so you can feel good and live good. Um, has SKU nutrition facts or one serving per container, serving size one can, but we're serving calories zero. Total fat zero grams per percent, cholesterol zero milligrams per percent, sodium zero milligrams per percent, total carbohydrate zero grams per percent, total sugar zero grams per percent, includes zero grams added sugar zero percent, protein zero grams per percent, potassium 50 milligrams two percent, zinc 0 0.5 milligrams four percent. Chromium 29 micrograms, 80%. So yeah, it's really high in chromium. But doesn't have any B vitamins or anything, like in other energy drinks. Um, in other ingredients, um, there's not too much stuff in it, but it's weird. It's like, the other ingredients are like split up. It has like a, that essential amino blend or whatever. It's like in between like the ingredients. So it's like layered, so it's like weird. But yeah, ingredients, chromated water, amino acid blend, L-leucine, l threonine, L-lysine, l and L-valine. Natural flavor, potassium citrate, citric acid, zinc citrate, chromium picolinate. Give us a call, phone numbers 1-855-346-6348. Visit us online at www.goodidea.us. Manufactured in the USA for Good Idea Incorporated, Corda Madeira, California, 94976. U.S. patent number US 2009-00181. 96A1, patent pending. So yeah, that's pretty much the entire can. So I'll let you see it right quick. I'll show off the can up close to them in a minute so you can see it a little bit better.
because he has a little bit reflective. But yeah, there's only one more flavor of these that I need to review that I have. Then after that I'll be reviewing the new um, Gorilla Mind Energy Drinks. Stay, stay tuned for those reviews. Because those ones I'm actually looking more forward to than, um, yeah, probably this one and the next one, you know. Because um, the first one of these drinks I had didn't really taste good. So, don't have high hopes for these anyway. But we shall see though. SKU now for the nutrition fact side. Everything's like basically zero, the first half of it. Other ingredients, distributor information and stuff. Okay, that's pretty much the entire can. Anyway, now I'm going to show off the can up close right quick. So hold on a minute. The Spart Vin Bar Black Current, good idea. Energy like sparkling water drink. Interesting name. I guess like a light purplish can. Looks a little bit darker though on my phone. Pretty minimalistic can design though. Not a whole lot of stuff on it to show off. Yeah, it's a silver top but it looks more gold though on my phone. Bottoms Best Buy Dating Production Code. Best Buy September 27th, 2024, so it's still fresh for a while. Zero calories, zero sweeteners. Zero caffeine. So yes, an energy drink, but zero caffeine, so that's interesting. Harness your natural energy, good idea. Feel good, live good. Black currant. I had like I think one other black currant drink before, so it's probably gonna be similar to that. It was that cycling frog drink that I did before. It's a QR code project to their website. It's like, looks messed up like it's melted or something, but I don't know. Vegan, non-GMO, nutrition box. Rest of the can info, the distributor information and stuff. SKU. Okay, that's pretty much the entire can. And now I'm gonna finish my review for it. So hold on a minute. Okay, I shot off the can up close. So now I'm gonna shake it up a little bit. You probably shouldn't shake it up too much, you know, because it's sparkling water. But I mean, when I'm gonna open it, taste it, and give my review for it. So hold on a minute. Okay, did not really explode? But yeah, the color is clear and artificial colors, but um, it's a little bit hard to tell though because it's like a colored top, you know? It's like a, you know, golden chrome. Um, but yeah, it's clear though and artificial colors. Um, so yeah, anyway, the scent. Ooh, whoa, 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 whoa. And yep, I think I actually might like this one compared to the last one that I reviewed. Because this one smells almost just like the Black Current um, Cycling Frog drink that I reviewed. Um, even though it says Black Current, which I'm, I'm not really for sure what a Black Current is supposed to taste like. Because I never had Black Current. But I think it's like some sort of vegetable, sort of like a carrot, I think. Maybe. But, um. The Black Current, like, Cycling Frog drink that I had. It's actually reminded me more of like a raspberry or like a pomegranate sort of flavor. Um, this reminds me of that a little bit. Like a dark berry scent. Definitely reminds me of like pomegranate or like um... Pomegranate acai. Or like um... Maybe like pomegranate raspberry. So like what it reminds me of. Definitely a strong sort of like a berry scent. I thought a current is supposed to be like a vegetable, but um, might be a fruit though, I don't know. It's 
Um, but yeah, it definitely smells like a, some sort of berry though. Um, actually smells pretty good. Yeah, I might actually like this one. So, oh yeah, oh yeah, oh yeah, oh yeah. But I'm anyway, and I'm gonna try it, so here goes. <clears throat> ooh, ooh. Well, 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 well. Well, well, well. Yep, 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 yep. Definitely. Better than the, um, the sea berry one that I did in my last review. Um, the half torn one. This one definitely tastes like how it smells, but, um, yeah, in the aftertaste, it gets a little bit more of a bitter sort of flavor, a little bit more of a earthy type of flavor. Yeah, at first you get, like, that sweet, um, sort of like a pomegranate or raspberry sort of taste. But then, um, once it gets to the back of your tongue and when it goes down your throat, it reminds me of, like, um, that one type of, um, diarrhea medicine. That's, I think it's called, like, a modium. Um, they have, like, different kinds. They had, like, a cherry one. They also had a different one that was sort of, like, well, yeah, I think it was a cherry one, but I was, like, a, a clear-colored liquid. It had, a, like, a weird taste to it. Um, this reminds me of that a little bit. Like the modium taste and the aftertaste. Um, so yeah, um, actually like the cycling frog over this one because um, that one didn't have that weird aftertaste. But yeah, this one has like a weird strong aftertaste. A little bitter and a little bit, um, not really sour. Well, maybe a little sour, but also. Yes, more like a tart bitterness. Yeah, it reminds me of, um, yeah, that Imodium medicine. But yeah, it reminds me also a little bit more of like a, yeah, like a black cherry sort of taste and aftertaste. But like a earthy black cherry. Um, but yeah, at first though, it has like the pomegranate, like raspberry sort of flavor, I guess, because of the black currant. But yeah, in the aftertaste, and it gets bad. Um, but yeah, it does have that sparkling water taste in there too a little bit, but, um, not too bad though. Um, yeah, I definitely like this one over the last one that I reviewed, but, um, if it didn't have that, like, weird aftertaste, like the Imodium aftertaste, um, this would actually be probably pretty lit, you know, just saying. Um, because, yeah, it reminds me of, like, pomegranate drinks and stuff. Um, but yeah, if it didn't have that aftertaste, it would definitely be way better. But energy-wise, though, um, it'll still work okay, um, the last one that I reviewed. I drank it during my lunch break at work, and then, um, I would last it about, like, um, till my third break, um, so it lasted almost, like, around two hours, so I'd still say energy-wise, maybe it lasts about an hour and a half of energy to about three hours of energy at the most, so, oh yeah, boys, it'll still definitely get lit, so, oh yeah, oh yeah, oh yeah, oh yeah, even though it doesn't have any caffeine, yeah, it definitely actually worked okay, though, but yeah, the price is okay, it's $2.69 at the Aikens Natural Market Grocery Store, I don't know where you'll be able to find this, so definitely be on the lookout for it. Um, yeah, that aftertaste, like, kills it for me, though. If it didn't have that aftertaste, this would actually be pretty lit. Definitely better than the um, last one that I reviewed. I gave the last one a 6 out of 10, but, um, probably should have gave it, like, a 5 out of 10, but, um, this one, though, I don't know, I like it, but I also dislike it at the same time. I sort of wanted to give it an 8 out of 10, but, um, I don't think it's, like, up there, though. Like, other 8 drinks, you know? So I'd probably give the, um, Black Current a good idea, like, Energy Like Sparkling Water drink. You know what, boys? I'm gonna give it a 7 out of 10, but, like, a high 7. So, oh, yeah, boys, it's still lit, so, oh, yeah, oh, yeah, oh, yeah, oh, yeah, oh, yeah. I'm gonna give it a 7 out of 10, oh, yeah. So that was a cool can design. Energy-wise, it works pretty good. It's okay priced. Um, the flavor tastes good at first, sort of like a pomegranate, like, um, like a pomegranate, like, um, cherry drink, but, um, yeah, the aftertaste, then it gets, like, really bad, though. A little bit like a medicine-y, like, um, syrupy taste and aftertaste. Um, but, yeah, if it didn't have that aftertaste, then that'd definitely be better, but, um, yeah, it kills it, though, see what I mean? So, yeah, I'm still gonna give it a 7 out of 10. 
So anyway, my next review is going to be the last one of these drinks that I'm going to be reviewing. Stay tuned for that review. Uh, and then after that will be the new Gorilla Mind Energy drinks. But I also wanted to shout out Matthew. I think his last name is like Schuler. Like, um, he like subscribed to me and like, um, some of his friends are also like following me and stuff. So I want to say a shout out to you guys, you know. So oh yeah, oh yeah, oh yeah, oh yeah. But anyway, yes, you know about car review, star video. Thanks for watching. See you guys later. Peace out. And bye.